Hi everyone, we're really good to see you guys today. Happy February 19th. Happy Friday. Today we're talking about Ultimate Legends, and more specifically we have Derek Thomas. Um, first of all, how many tokens should we have? Is is there only one this week? Because I'm only seeing a solo challenge with one of them on there. Did I miss out? Did the token expire yet? I thought it lasted a whole week. So let me know because I'm going to play that solo tonight. So yeah, just let me know if I'm behind already because does it really take 15 weeks for a free one, dude? 15 weeks is literally in June. So I don't really understand what EA is doing here if it's 15 weeks. I think I missed out. I think I'm missing. If it's 15 weeks, bro, GG. Derek Thomas and Jim Thorpe are coming tomorrow. Uh, Jim Thorpe, um, he has really high Excel, really high agility, which is perfect. High break tackle, high carrying, high cod, perfect. His speed is only a 95, though. So powered up 96, sprinter 98. I mean, at that point, just have Bo Jackson, right? A little bit cheaper. Bo is on that Raiders theme team, a better theme team. But if you run a Giants theme team or other theme teams, Jim Thorpe will have 99 speed for you. But that's Jim Thorpe. I'm not going to get him. Maybe you guys will. All right. Next. TJ Watt might get replaced tomorrow. Okay. By Derek Thomas. Okay. Now, I position changed Derek Thomas. So he might be okay. Uh, I'm going to keep LT for sure. LT is a glitch. If you get rid of LT, that's on you. But TJ Watt, we're going to compare him here against, you know, our guy, Derek Thomas. So TJ Watt has powered up, chemmed up 92 speed. Derek Thomas has powered up, chemmed up 94. That's plus two. Okay. Plus two speed for Derek Thomas. Acceleration, that's going to be won by Derek Thomas by one. He has 97, he'll have 96. Strength, he has 84. Derek Thomas will have 91. Derek Thomas is better. Powered up, chemmed up. Derek Thomas will have 99 tackle. So will TJ Watt. Play rec, powered up, chemmed up. TJ Watt is 99. Derek Thomas will have 98. So plus one for TJ Watt. Block Shed, both 99. Power Move and Finesse Move. Powered up, Tom Thomas has 98 and 97 Power Move Finesse Move. Which is just so good. Now let's go to Zone Coverage. Zone Coverage. 71 for TJ Watt. Let's go to Derek Thomas. If his zone's like a 50, then that could be a difference. His zone coverage is a... Probably he'll be a 70, 71 zone too. Probably same exact zone coverage. So, Dara Thomas is way better. There's not even a question. So, I'll go ahead and power up Derek Thomas. He's already position changed. Um, I'll probably power down TJ Watt through training intervals. I don't know what I'll do, actually. I'll figure it out later. But the whole point of the story, what I'm saying, though, is trust me, bro. Like, it's just Derek Thomas is better. And he's clearly endgame. Ricky Jackson's really good, too, though. So, I don't know who'll be better, Jackson or him. But Derek Thomas is so good. I can't really go wrong with that shit. So... What's going to essentially happen is I'm going to probably go ahead and definitely power up past Lawrence Taylor for a 96. See, Lawrence Taylor has high strength, high excel, high speed. The only thing he doesn't have is like 99 block shed, but I mean that's still really good of a car with that speed and excel. So LT power up past 96 He's not going anywhere. 
But then we go with TJ Watt, even though he's a 99, Derek Thomas kills him. Two better speed. I'm going to take that two better speed any day of the week. Right? So, like I said, guys, you know, save the coins. You know, I can pro I'm not sure how much TJ Watt goes for, but I'm not going to sell him just yet because I'm going to use him tonight in the weekend league. But I'm just saying right now, like, you get Derek Thomas, you get Lawrence Taylor. Oh, boy. Those are two edge, you know, two edge protectors you need. Um, let's go with TJ Watt here. You know, I bought him for 550, right? You know, I bought him for 550 all the way back in the day, and hopefully goes for still 400k. Barely. All right, people are starting to sell him here. Okay. So I'll sell him for about 400k. You know, I'm gonna get most of my coins back. I bought him for 550. You know, I lose 150k, but I got good value out of him. I literally used him for four weeks. It's hard to believe that team of the year has been out now for about four weeks ish. So I got value out of him, and then I'll sell him. All right. So overall, like I said, you know, TJ Watt, hell of a player, right? Hell of a player. It's just when you look at, you know, Derek Thomas, like, it's over. The guy is just immensely better. So, that's my move. And even though it's the same overall, it's still an upgrade, right? And like I said, Kevin Mawai is not sold yet. But once he sells and I sell Lawrence Taylor, because, you know, the power I passed, 96. Once I sell that 96 power I passed Lawrence Taylor... I'm going to literally be close to three, you know, two mil coins. So I have two mil coins. I sell TJ Watt. I'm at 2.4 mil. You know, I'm set. Now, Kevin Mawai here is, you know, just kind of being a little bitch, right? So I'll wait to sell him because he's just not selling right now. But I'll clear about 300K there. And then you sell Lawrence Taylor. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? Um, I got a lot of these elites right now, but I'm saving all these elites for maybe Team Diamonds 2, all right, down the road, all right. So the one thing I recommend too is exchange your silvers, try to pull some rare power-ups like McLaurin or Justin Reed, or right. So, but as of right now, bro, the market did not drop that much. I would not really be cashing on that that much. But Derek Thomas, I mean, he might go for a lot of coins. You know, maybe 600, 700K, but I mean, I'm selling TJ Watt. So it's like, dude, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, what up? You know, like I literally get, you know, the coins back pretty much. So hopefully he goes for like 500K. But he'll probably go for like 700k because Derek Thomas is really good. Chiefs theme teams. Oh my god. 96 speed. Shut up. So we'll see what happens, bro. I wish he was Ravens Ken, but whatever. Um, our defense will be even more powerful. I'm still rocking with Michael Strahan and John Abraham and Deion Sanders and Marcus Peters and Derwin James, Jamal Adams. You know, some people aren't beat yet. Middle linebackers. I'm still going with Devin White, Speed Cheese, high hit power. You know, good zone. I feel like, honestly, though, Derek Thomas and LT powered up, chemmed up, 9-9 nine, nine overall. I just don't really see him being beat. I mean, they have 94 speed each with Shaker. You know, it's just like, I mean, that's fast. Sprinter 95. I mean, geez, that's fast for a linebacker. 95 speed. Damn, that's fast. Do you really expect a 97 speed linebacker that good? I don't know. So maybe a 99 in like May, May, but right now, bro, I'm rolling with that car. I'm not going to look back. Bye, guys. Take care, and I hope you guys are doing the same thing I'm doing, man.